So we have here the moon card. This is about like secrets, uh, mystery, the occult. Um, there's something kind of deceptive happening, okay? This is telling you to see the forest through the trees, like look beyond, use your intuition. Um, whatever I hear, like whatever your feminine intuition is like guiding you or just your intuition in general. Um, but there is some sort of secret here or things are not as they seem. There is some sort of illusion and this has to do with communication. Okay. This is, um, this is the page who's like kind of curious. Um, they might come off a little mischievous or, or like even sneaky, but that's actually not their MO I'm hearing. Um, they're just very blunt and to the point with their communication. We have fireworks going off too, but, um, there may be some sort of delay this in delay. Um, it, it has to do, yeah, this delayed communication could have to do with Mercury and retrograde, but it has to do with this secret, obviously, or something not being as it seems. And now for some reason, we have like someone's wishes and desires are in reverse. Um, there's supposed to be a love offer coming in, but it's in reverse. And we have someone here who's been like very patient. This person's been blending practicality and spirituality, but it's in the you reverse. You also feel that like your wishes and desires are like upside down right now like they're not being fulfilled uh they're not being met and um you might really be like wanting um a commitment a devotion like a proposal or someone asking you out on a date or a romantic gesture um it's the night of love coming forward but it's in reverse so someone's uh definitely like I actually just see like a lot of cups being poured out. It's like someone has a lot of emotions and a lot of love. And it's like someone's been very patient, but like they can't be patient anymore. And like, this is like, I just see like someone's cup, like being like poured like upside down. We have here that someone has gifts and abilities. Someone is very magical or there are like some sort of illusions here. Things are definitely not as they seem. Um, this could be due to magic or the occult. Um, but someone does have the power to like manifest whatever they want. This person is very magical. Uh, you're coming through as a star seed, as gifted and very powerful. The emperor here. So this can be authority or um, a father figure. Or this is someone who makes like a good leader. Um, this person probably has their own like land or domain that they already rule over. Um, this person's powerful. They're an influencer. Um, they probably are like a spokesperson or just do really good in the public eye. They could be a notable figure or even a we celebrity. Have a hierarchy stuck here <laughs> to the to the emperor. So this person could um, be like the hierarchy as well and a powerful. person person um or there's definitely like uh, an organization or corporate corporate uh, organization or corporation working uh behind this person uh there's contracts here something very formal um contracts wedding something very formal um tradition is coming through very yeah, so strong. we have someone here who's like very upset about something um things not working out or like a mess that was created um it's because of some sort of secret here there's some sort of secret or something is not as it seems and this is causing like an upset okay it's causing delays in this person's plans it's it's got everything upside down this person feels like very um trapped like this is someone who's been through deceit betrayal it's a very painful ending or closing of a cycle um where there was a lot of like i hear just turmoil like a lot of like heartache and just like swords in the literal back like this person may have been backstabbed by very many people um and this is like what's and like it's like this was a hidden though this was like a secret but we do have a three of cups here. So celebration is on the way or some sort of upcoming event is going to be um, <laughs> really exciting for you. There's like fireworks and there's a uh, lights flickering and stuff. So um, some sort of event is going to be um, the event of a lifetime of hearing. It's a lot of celebrating.
So we have someone here who's indecisive. Uh, this person's on the fence. They feel like they don't have all the facts or they can't see everything for what it is. Uh, they feel blindfolded in some sort of way. There's also a huge responsibility here, the weight of the world on someone's shoulders or back. Um, just feeling very overburdened, overworked. Uh, and then we have this queen of wands here. So you could be dealing with fire energy, um, Aries, uh, Leo Sagittarius. Uh, this person's usually very charming, very charismatic, very outgoing. Um, they're humanitarian. They might be an activist. They do really well in the public eye. They're extremely generous and funny. Uh, very like loving and outgoing. Yeah, this person's been trying to review facts, but they feel like they don't have all of the facts. So this is what's like stopping them from taking action. This is why they're just like sitting on the fence. They hear like uh, not a like, concrete evidence. Um, so this person's like over like reviewing this now, but they can't take action because they feel like they don't have all of the facts here. Like something's like uh, keeping we them back. Here they could be dealing with possibly like a younger fire sign, um, Aries Leo Sagittarius. This person's very passionate, very motivated, high energy. This person doesn't like to dilly dally. They're probably are like run around a lot if they're younger or they're very like adventurous, very sporty. Um, and then we have here a mother and a father. Um, so we have uh, the Empress and the Emperor here. Um, mother and father vibes, uh, partnership, obviously. Uh, but this is also like authority, um, power, um, control, like boss. And then um, we also have here this mother who is like about fertility, abundance, um, nurturing energy. And we have here um, possibly air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This person's very intellectual. This person also values like data, facts, um, resources, analytics is coming through, academic pursuits, well-read, well-versed, probably very articulate. This person is really good at taking action, but it's like well-thought-out action. Um, this person might also hold like a powerful position or authoritative kind of role uh this person's probably trained or skilled in whatever they sometimes, do sometimes um this person can come off a little cold or detached it's because they're like laser focused or they're really focused on um whatever it is that they're analyzing okay this person likes to spy gather facts evidence knowledge data um, getting like boss vibes here though or powerful or this person is looked up to in some sort of way like they're like a leader or mentor or coach is kind of like what's coming up or they do give off father vibes as well uh it might be a little bit more star seed so this is like starting a new beginning um taking a leap of faith this is a very like galactical card as well so um a star being is someone who um has come from another like planet or universe so there's lots of star seeds here right now we're helping everyone awaken during this like time of transition and grand experiment so you may resonate with the cosmos um with uh different galactic star race races or beings um you might really uh you might want to travel like throughout space you might be extremely spiritual you might have gifts and abilities, like maybe you can use divination tools. We're all here. Um, a lot of angels are coming through right now, uh, which is also like galactical beings. Um, but you're all here to help with this awakening and ascension process that's ha that's um, happening as have we a speak. new beginning here. I'm hearing about the new earth um, and you have a lot of knowledge to share because you are a star seed. Uh, so this is like taking a leap into the unknown. We also um, have a lot of people here reviewing knowledge from a higher vantage point. Like you have higher intelligence to share with people um we also have someone who's trying to like understand uh star seeds understand um alien or different star races or beings um trying to understand spirituality the devil card here but it was actually in reverse um so someone's coming out of feeling like bound stuck trapped low vibrational energy it's almost like breaking free in a sense which star seeds are helping people to do right now they're like kind of defeating this low vibrational energy by just being them by just being the light and sharing this light with others and informing people about like what it is to be a star seed because everyone's going to realize that we all come from the cosmos in the end and people are going to awaken to their galactic coding and their knowledge that is important for us to share at this time so 
This is coming out of feeling bound, stuck, trapped, low vibration, addictions, codependencies, um, just feeling bound by the I'm devil. I'm also getting a message coming from across seas. You might have been patiently like waiting on this. Or this is someone who's been like waiting, 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 and they haven't like seen this happen. So now they're in this state of like, should I go or should I stay? Like, or maybe I should reevaluate. Um, the next step would be your ships coming in. So this person's been waiting a long time for maybe their wishes and desires to come in, but there there was this oppressed like block feeling here, or like this is trying to like <laughs> stop this star seed from taking a new leap of faith or beginning.